Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Brian from Kingdom Hearts Union Cross Nation, and in today's video, we got some exciting new news where we are finally getting the new Keyblade that I've been talking about, or at least I've been talking about on like Discord and social media and stuff. Um, I don't think I brought it up in a video uh, anytime recently, but at least in like Discord and stuff, I've been mentioning that like we're definitely going to get a new Keyblade now that the uh, new world is introduced or when the new world got introduced so we finally have it or at least JP finally got it and we got some information on it as well uh, so this is the outer look of it okay and I have some pictures that were provided to me through discord uh, for that I can show you guys okay but ignoring the story <laughs> the main thing of concern or not concerned, the main thing to note about the Keyblade is that it contains slots, or at least a slot, that will provide the slot bonus value regardless of whether or not the metal is upright or reverse, okay? So, and I'll put up a picture real quick. So that's what the, the outer looks like, and for a more detailed look at it. Okay, so this is what the actual Keyblade looks like, like uh, right there, okay? Um, it, it's all right. It's ba it's basically the building that Ralph, or at least I believe that's the building that Ralph likes to, uh, you know, go up and down for the for the Wreck It Ralph game in the movie. Um, but those are what the slots look like. Okay, now keep in mind this is a level one Keyblade, uh, so these are the base multipliers. Uh, but from what people are telling me, and it's not really too confirmed just yet, just because of the fact that as of right now in the JP version of the game, the Keyblade can only be evolved up to level 5 as of right now, so it's not quite confirmed, but even even at just level 5, the, metals, the Keyblade's already kind of OP. I mean, yeah, the Keyblade's already kind of OP, just because of the fact that I'll show you right now. So that's the base form at level 1. And it has some pretty decent multipliers already at uh, level 1, okay? When you bring it to level 5 though, okay, these are the multiplayer values at level 5, okay? It already goes up to times 2.5 on slot 5 and 2.0 and just kind of goes around there, alright? So that's already pretty decent, alright, for a level 5 Keyblade. Uh, that's not too different from like, what, level 20 Keyblades for the rest of the Keyblades or whatnot? So that's actually really good for a level 5. And then, that's not even taking into consideration once once you add actual sub-slots to the Keyblade itself. So this was another picture uh, given to me through Discord, where they added all of their 120 uh, slots, or you know, sub-slots to the Keyblade, and it literally straight up already boosted the value of the sub-slots all the way to like 5.6, okay? Uh, which is absolutely huge. Now. Aside from the fact that the Keyblade uh, ignores whether or not it's uh, upright or reverse for the Keyblade slots, the main thing that I am most ecstatic for, that I appreciate the most, is that we finally have another Keyblade in the game that can actually finally use power upright metals in slot 5, okay? Um, even just slot 4 would have been good enough for me, but the fact we even have slot 5 and the fact that it's finally the first Keyblade in the game that has a good multiplier on slot 5 for power upright is absolutely game-changing, okay? Because um, truthfully, out of all of the attributes in the game, um, the attributes that probably got kind of like cucked <laughs> the most in terms of like being actually usable are power upright because there's barely any power upright slots in the game in terms of damage so slots uh, three four and five there's 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 barely any there's only like two keyblades so Olympia and uh, what's it called Mugo glory and even then both of those have a really bad slot five multiplier so it's like eh. That's going to absolutely change things a lot. Very, very happy about that. On top of the fact, of course, that you can even uh, do any combination of upright and reverse. You can basically just use all your best metals on one Keyblade. It's, to me, that's just that's just insane. That's really cool. I love it a lot. Uh, this is definitely going to be the best Keyblade from now on for sure. Even upon release at just level 5, it's going to be automatically the best. Uh, unless you happen to have your Fairy Stars evolved to like 50 or something like that. Something ridiculous. But... 
Other than that, I just wanted to share this awesome news with you guys. Uh, let me know what your thoughts and opinions are in the comment section down below. What type of setups do you think you can create on the Keyblade to help make it busted as possible? But other than that, if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like, subscribe, and hit that bell button. It's the best way I know when I upload more videos such as this one. My name is Brian from Kinemon Team Cross Nation, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace, guys.